So you, I remember when you were living in the shed and I remember seeing that shed and I was like, it, I, it's funny to hear that you say that was a come up. And I thought, I'm thinking to myself, that was not a come up. Dude, but, no, but it, it was the roof. No, no. I, I totally get what you're saying. I, yeah. I, I get what you're saying. I just totally, I'm just thinking to myself, that's like looking at where you live now to where that is. That's oh, not, dude, yeah. That's not yeah, a come up. Yeah, not even close. <laughs> but, um, so what, when, when, when was your, when was your aha moment when you said, okay, like, I know you, I know you said a few minutes ago, it was in, it's been in messing with you in your head, your lifestyle stuff. But when, when was your aha moment? Like you said, okay, I'm going to, I'm, I'm going to make a claim and I'm going to change. Uh, I think my kid hadn't spoken to me in about five years. And all of you guys were telling me, you know what, you just got to send her an email. You just got to, just let her know you're thinking of her. And I'm like, yeah, that's a good idea. And I was sitting there one night and uh, I saw my brother posted something and then my daughter had answered him. And so I figured, go for broke, right here, right now, let's just do it. So, so I did, and uh, I'd been a good boy for a while by then, but I didn't really feel worthy, you know? And, and the only way I was gonna ever feel worthy is if my kid wanted, a, you know, anything to do with your dad. Is that one, that one had me messed up for a long time. But uh, turned out she did, and uh, things have been pretty awesome since then. Things have been real. And that was the aha. It was, I realized that if I don't change myself, if I don't, you know, I, I can't keep thinking, you know, well, you mouth off to me, I'm going to make a phone call. Instead of doing that, just shake my head and walk away from them when they mouth off or whatever. Try to, I got to, I got to earn this. I got to earn this. And, and my kid is something that, well, I guess most people with their kids, they just think, well, I had you, you're mine. I never felt like I deserved mine. Mine was, to me, she was the be all and all. And she, she still is. But that was it, was finally going forward to talk to her and her deciding she actually wanted to have a relationship with me. I had to be worth it. And that was my aha moment. Okay. That was absolutely it. And that's when you felt like Christ was really coming yeah. more in your life? Yeah. And is that moment? Okay. I've been going through it. I've been talking with Carboneau. And, and at one point I told Carboneau, dude, I don't get it. But ever since I've been a Christian, my life's been friggin' harder. <laughs> you know? And, well, that's true. You know, I just assume, you know, it's great. I walk outside. I feel like I'm getting stepped on like a beer can, you know? And, uh, but then all of a sudden that stuff came through with low. And that changed everything. And it did. That was it.